Happy Shark Week. I know, I know, my videos tend to come out a week or three later than when I film them, but today itself is Shark Appreciation Day. And I know the perfect place to go. It's July 14th, by the way. And they're having some shark and ray appreciation events today. I hope the otters are out. It's been a while since I've seen them. Keeping up with today's theme in this first room, we're going to look for a zebra shark and a bonnet head shark. I'm assuming that's how you pronounce that. There's Mr. Zebra Shark. Well, the zebra shark keeps hiding from me. And I have yet to find the bonnet head shark. And you know, whether I pronounced it right or not, I know it's not called the bonehead shark. I heard someone else say that. There it is, there's the bonnet head. Okay, time to move on. I'm getting kind of loud in here. Yes, I know I show this every single time, but can you blame me? It's awesome. More sharks. Man, look at that guy. Not a shark, but I haven't shown him in a while. Also not a shark, but I'd never noticed a dolphin in this exhibit before, so I'm showing him too. I like his expression. He's also surprised to see the dolphin. Another one. Two dolphins. Two. Uh, uh, uh. I almost walked right by the thing that they're doing for Shark Week. Almost didn't even see it. Let's go see what they're doing. Hi. Hi. Good. How are you guys? Good. Shark and Ray Awareness Day. That's why I'm here. Oh, that's why you're here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, good. Welcome. I've been filming every single shark so far. So what all do you have going on here? This is just slap bracelets if you want to make a slap bracelet. Ooh. And then there's a board over there that you can write your name, pledging that you will be an ambassador to Sharks and Rays. Awesome. And then we have little certificates. Okay. And stickers. Do you want a sticker? Yes, I want a sticker. Yes. <laughs> slab bracelet which I believe I will take home and do in better lighting with my own art supplies. It will have sharks on it. Little hammerhead plush. And here we go. We can pledge our appreciation. Learn to save sharks and rays. As I stumble all over my words. Shark and ray And I got a certificate. You guys, writing my name on that board was a little bit hard to do while filming. Here's some more sharks. Badly lit sharks. Actually, the lighting in here is fine. Really aesthetic. But my phone does not like low light. As you might know if you've seen any of my cave videos. There's that big guy again. Man, I wonder who he ate. Made it to the second station. Too dark to show it, so here's some fish instead. There we go. This is an actual stingray barb. I have some more stickers. So this is what stingrays and teeth look like. So oh, cool. Four of them in there. And this is what a stingray's jaw looks like. So this is cartilage. Er, this is a replica because actual stingray jaws are made of cartilage. So we can't really get an actual one. So we have a replica. Oh, that's cool. This is a plushy stingray. And the underside. So these are its gills. This is its mouth. And these are pretty much its equivalent to nostrils. So it's kind of how it smells things. Um, we have this little quiz, if you want to take it, you don't have to. Yeah, one. that is awesome. And then we have uh, some stickers, and that's it. Have a good day. Sweet, thank you. 
So I got another coloring sheet, a quiz. I learned that stingray tails are actually retractable like cat claws. Isn't that cool? I think what I'm gonna do is just do the quiz later when I get home and see how much of this stuff I remember. And there we have our first glimpse of the race today. One of them just relaxing down there. And they're actually in the light today. I don't think I've been able to get a good shot of these guys before. Pretty cute how he's standing in his water dish. Didn't catch it on film, but I just got jump scared by this guy. I forgot he was in here. It's a western hobnose snake. Yes, the otters are out. Seriously, just watch these things all day. So cute. It's such an inviting looking pool. Don't you just want to jump in? Uh, of course, there are sharks in there. And then we have this guy. Nothing like him in this pool. But I still wouldn't want to dive in. I don't know. Maybe if I were in the cage. I wonder how much that is. Oh, I've never noticed that up there. Full patio. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm glad to see they have a real inhabitant back in this exhibit. Last time I was here, it was just a plush bird perched right up there. Hi there, you're pretty. And that's what he is. A green Arakari. Arakari? Anyone else now? Scariest part of the day right here, the anaconda. Who is never in a good spot with lighting like this. First time I've ever gotten a good shot. Well, I was gonna say hi to Jenny May. She appears to be hiding. I don't know, maybe she's just not in there. I hope she's okay. And now it's time for excess jellyfish footage. Yeah, yeah. Did they take off their stairs? No. Red things? Yeah, they did. Yeah. 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 Jellyfish is relaxed. He's all tangled up on himself. Here we go. Guess what it's time for? Sharkses. Pause to watch this before you guys. Ooh. Hi guys, happy shark day. that shark diving pool by the way made it to another station they have this cool little banner that you can stand with sharks and see how you compare I'm 510 so I am nearly as tall as a black tip reef shark who is six feet what else you guys got Ooh. it's her tiger shark jaw this one's actually real Ooh, a real tiger shark jaw right there her fingers mm -hmm. Feels kind of like my cat's teeth. <laughs> and then you've also got the hammerhead shark jaw, which is just a replica of that super shark jaw. Cool. So we have a replica.
replica of a hammerhead shark. If I didn't know that, it kind of looks like a bat skeleton or something. And what did you say, zebra shark for that one? Is that a zebra? Yep. And that one's a zebra shark. And sharks can lose up to 30,000 teeth in a lifetime. That's about as many as this jar of corn kernels here that it's too dark for you to see. We got some more coloring sheets too. Man, I should have brought a bag today. I am accumulating. Whoa, I love the lighting in here. I've never seen this exhibit. There's a fish. Looks like it's a pine cone fish. see them because of what's across the way. There's a bear. Hi, bear. What you doing back there? There's three of them in this exhibit. I never noticed that before. The other two are right back there lurking in the shadows. No idea why I said it like that. Oh, they're so cute. Pretty glad we don't have them around here, though. And that's it for Shark Day. Well, let me get back to the car. I'll show you guys what I got in there. I don't know what's worse, the wind outside or the air conditioning in the car, but it's summer. What you gonna do? Here's what I picked up. Race sticker. Shark sticker. That's backwards. Shark sticker. What else? They actually had four new coloring pages there today. I thought that was really cool. There's one. Two, three, uh, 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 and four. Taking them home to do with my real art supplies. We've got some Shark and Ray Awareness Day pamphlets. Here we go. Man, this lighting. Can you? Trust me, that's what they are. A certificate acknowledging that I was something or other. 
more stuff. More stuff. These are actually kind of cute. And finally, another thing. Oh yeah. And my slap bracelet. Forgot I had that on. I'm gonna point it at you. And I guess that's that. Time to go home and edit and see you guys next week. I'm gonna point it at you. <laughs>